Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we've got Speedy B's new F405 stack. I'm Jeff with Titan FPV. Let's dive in. Speedy B just launched their V3 version of their budget stack. This one's coming in at $69.99 US dollars. So for 2022, this is about as budget of a stack as you're going to get. Gone are the days of the $40 Diatone Mamba stacks. This is what we have today. Let's open up the box and see what we've got inside. All right, looks like we've got the flight controller and the 4 in 1 ESC. This is an F405 with a BMI 270 gyro. It does have a built in barometer and built in Bluetooth, so you can use. The SpeedyB app to configure uh, your flight controller and ESC uh, via Bluetooth on your smart device. It also has a battery indicator. These LEDs light up just depending on your battery cell voltage. So that's something that I haven't seen before. It's definitely welcome in a budget offering. You do have four available UARTs that are open. One is used for ESC telemetry, so you do have four additional open UARTs. USB-C on board. There is a plug for DJI, or you can also use that for HD0. You see there's an SD card slot on the bottom for a micro SD card. This will take up a 4 gig card to log black box data. So that's an, another good option for this budget stack. And not much else to see there with the flight controller. Let's see what the four in one looks like. Looks like you've got some nice large pads. This is a 50 amp BL Heli S ESC. Pinouts for your capacitor. All in all looks like a Clean ESC. Let's see what accessories come in the box. So we've got an XT60 connector. It's already soldered up. This is one of the high quality ones. We do have a capacitor with uh, shriek wrap on the leads to prevent a uh, short, so that's good. It's a 1500 microfarad 35 volt capacitor, so that should be good to reduce the uh, noise going to your VTX. You've got your 4 in 1 ESC to flight controller plug, as well as the DJI or HD0 plug. You may have to rewire this if you want to use this for HD zero. The reason I picked up this stack, I was going to do a budget build and a lot of the components that I have, I keep around for a while. I picked them up on numerous sales. Uh, you can definitely check out the FPV sales alert group uh, on Facebook. I'll post a link in the video description. Johnny five has up that group. It's got some great deals for you, but a lot of the components that I have have just been sitting around for a bit, and uh, I want to do a budget build for 2022, but it's not going to help you guys if the components aren't readily available. So if I'm using an old version or, or a flight controller with an old gyro that's no longer made, so I wanted to get something new uh, that I picked up this year so I can do this 2022 build. I wonder if you can guess what frame I've chosen. We're going to be running HD zero, of course. So there's really no budget as far as uh, the VTX. We, we got to go with the one watt. I'll give you that bit of information. Uh, it is going to be a five inch build. Post down in the comments, what frame do you think I went with? So stay tuned for that. I will do a follow up video. Let's see how this flight controller performs, how easy the setup was. If I ran into any issues, that will be in the budget build for 2022 video. Thanks again for tuning in guys. As always, if you're not subscribed, please do so. Click the notification bell. 
leave a comment down below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can, and we'll catch you in the next one.